Hello guys, welcome back to my channel for another G-Shock tutorial video. So for today, I'm going to unboxing and reviewing this model of uh, GA-2200BB-1 ADR. So this model is an all new carbon core guard model featuring a lightweight carbon uh, fiber reinforced series. And before we get started, just make sure you subscribe to the channel just by clicking the red button down there so you can keep up to date with what's happening. So what we are waiting for? Let's G! The model of the watch is GA-2200BB-1ADR5674 case number. So let's open it. This is international warranty card. One year coverage battery and machine. International warranty regulations. So you can see all the business partner of g -Shock all over the world. So this is our company, Kuwait Al Battle Brothers Establishment. Module number 5674. Manual booklet guide. So this is the canister can. Specifications: case bezel material resin. Resin band Mineral glass Neo bright Shock resistant Carbon core guard Structure and 200 meters water resistance size of case 50.8 lug to lug from here to here 47.1 the diameter of the watch from here to here and the thickness is 12.8 millimeters total weight is 57 grams so other features you can see on your screen. Now let's take a look at the watch back of the case. So engraving at back of the case the G logo and carbon core guard. Here is 5674 case number and the model of the watch is GA-2200BB. Water resist 20 bar it means 200 meters water resistance. Japan movement, stainless steel, and the watch is case in Thailand. So it has four screws. The band is quick release mechanism. So you can easily remove by your own. Now let's go to buckle. So the buckle is plastic. The loop or keeper is resin. So 
So let's have a look in front of the watch. Okay, let's go first to the band. So the band is thick and it has a unique design. So in front of the watch, so on the bezel, uh, on the upper bezel, you, it's written here the G-Shock. So on the screen, you can see here the indicator of world time stopwatch alarm timer. So standard analog hand. And this is the negative display of digital hour. And the watch is radium guys. On the bezel, it has six screws design. The watch, it has a five buttons, two from my left side and two from my right side. One below is light. So now I will teach you every functions of the watch. So let's go first here to adjust. So this is for adjusting the time. So press hold. After beep release, now you consider the country. So Jeddah. Kuwait time is Je uh, Kuwait is Jeddah time. Then this is forward button, like Dubai, for example. And then press one time adjust. So it will automatically. Uh, setting the time everything guys the months the dates everything so we're clear for the adjust let's move to mode button so mode button it has a uh, word time you can see here the indicator guys it's moving stopwatch timer alarm and normal or uh, timekeeping normal timekeeping or display configuration so world time you can see here all the uh, time other countries for example so Delhi Kathmandu Dhaka Bangkok Singapore Hong Kong Beijing Taipei so this is world time guys UTC to for for now in Tokyo so this is Adelaide Adelaide yeah Adelaide 3 14 in the morning now let's move to stopwatch stopwatch so this is start button countdown timer guys so 1 to 100 if you want to stop press start and then reset button hold again for timer so timer same procedure of adjusting the time press hold adjust after beep release or for, for example um, one minute one minute then one time adjust and then press start So that is timer guys. Alarm. So how many alarms we have? Two, three, 
4, 5. So, 5 alarms. 4, 5 alarms. And standard international global time zone. So, how to set alarm? Uh, same procedure of adjusting the time. Press adjust hold. After beep, release. So, this is forward button. You can see there the hour is blinking. For example, 3 in the morning. Okay. Then, press one time adjust. Now, the alarm one is acting. On. And, normal timekeeping. So, this reset button. So, if you press hold. It swap to uh, UTC. So, this is Sydney. Our UTC. 34 in Sydney, Australia. Oh, 354. So this is for swapping for um, world time. Then, so this start button, so it will change to digital hour, uh, day, months, and date. And this is light button. So now let's try this on my wrist. Even the uh, the band is thick, but it's very comfortable, guys. When you're wearing the watch. Date release of this watch last July uh, 2021. The price of the watch is $130. In Philippine money is 6,435 pesos guys. Okay guys, so that is it. Uh, thanks so much for watching and I hope you learned from our video. And if yes, uh, please comment down below Please like share and subscribe and see you on my next vlog guys. Peace